Should I do an intro? Should I say anything? I don't know. I just woke up. And I came out here. I watched some YouTube. And now I'm playing a game. Hey guys. We're playing Rimworld. Yes, I drink out of mason jars. Because they're great. And they're free. I mean, clean them out and everything, they're all good. Alrighty then. Let's speed this up. Oh, people are actually going out and planting and cutting, and look at that. They're doing their jobs. Plant my fucking hops, damn it. The fuck is the matter with all you people? Was Jen the only person that was actually out here doing anything? Crane Hall. Oh, yeah, we're at 840 right now, and I believe it was... Is it 980? It was 980 for those, and then it was another 29 for these. This is 700. It's 980 right there. And then 40 for each of these. Inspired trade, Cody. It's the wrong inspiration, jackass. You're supposed to make a legendary giant sculpture. Instead, you made a legendary small sculpture. And you didn't even get to do that because I reloaded, so that way you would be able to finish it properly and you're just a fucking cunt didn't even get the thing pop up again plant the goddamn hops what the fuck is the matter with you people corn is really good if you want it to be a little bit more idle because, I mean, they've been neglecting the majority of the crops for a while. Now they're deciding they're actually going to come do shit. But, um, yeah, that was a lot of corn for a small little plot down here. It's really good for yield. And then rice just happens to grow fast. So if you want, you could start off just growing a bunch of rice to get it to get your food up quickly in a short period of time and then do the corn. I'll just keep that in mind. And Blackville's like, I'm plant here, plant here, plant here, plant here, plant here, plant here. Absalom is like, I'm gonna plant this eventually. Sweet, we've got five marine helmets now. So these two are normal, good, excellent, and excellent. Oh, I know why they look brighter. It's because they're closer to the lamp. I'm stupid. Keep forgetting that that's my bionic heart. Look at all the beer I got. Fumiko is pregnant. Yeah, if my animals could stop miscarrying due to um, malnutrition. That would be great because they really should not be whatsoever. Right, dromedaries are black bell. And then everything else is gen except for the two that are bonded to Sam. So I'll probably send, um, since I'm going to be carrying like all of my worth with Jen, she's going to have all of the animals as well, so um, even though she'll be by herself, she's going to have all of the cougars and uh, panthers and the dogs and the polar bear and the elephant. She's So she's going to be pretty well defended. They could, the group of animals, um, if I happen to be positioned right, could easily take down four or five guys. I mean, the elephant alone has taken out three guys, but that's been one-on-one -on -one encounters. If it's one versus three, that's three times the amount of damage is, was being done before. How long you got? 2.3 days. And 3.9 days left. Yeah, we cut it pretty close on that one. I am... I suppose I'm fairly remote 
um, compared to a lot of places that I could be. I mean, if I was over here in the desert, then I mean, that's probably about as remote as you could get on this entire area, unless you were, like, right up here in this temperate swamp. I'm in tropics. Temperate, 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 boreal. This is all tundra up here. I'm curious if ever, if anybody has ever like successfully just lived up in a, a super cold area. I'd assume uh, food would be the major factor in how well you could do. So I'm I'm assuming like one person could probably get along pretty well up here if you uh, got them clothed really quickly and uh, kept them warm and just killed animals for food. I'm assuming you could you could survive pretty well by yourself. That's if they actually are like plants and shit up here properly. Or not not necessarily plants, but I mean like if there's actually stuff on the map up there rather than just some little piece of crap. We might have to check that out on one of the playthroughs because um, this is actually, I'm playing on an easier difficulty. That's why I'm not getting ambushed by like shitloads of guys and not being attacked by, you know, only recently did we start getting some serious attacks. And those aren't even serious, because, I mean, I am i haven't been at risk at losing people for the most part. Oh yeah, all my hops are growing now. Good. Fucking lazy bastards. That is, like, one of our primary exports. Beer is our exports. We don't really export the medicine. We pretty much use it up really quick. Um, yeah, we're gonna have to streamline the storage of all of our materials. Because the cloth is used for both medicine and for clothing. So if we could have all of our production fairly close together and then have it on the other side of the initial production of it. So you'd want to have like the food on one side of the cooking and then you'd want to have all of the storage and stuff close to all of the production and I just I had it with people and then stuff further over here missions not in a bad spot actually because he doesn't have to come grab any of this stuff and he doesn't really have to grab too much from over here a group of travelers from Alliance of Gera are passing by Gero are the savages that I made friends with, and then Dewera are the the Outlander Union. Got quite a bit of chocolate. Yeah, I've got way too much brewery stuff up here compared to how much I actually make. Like, if that was our only export, I'd have this as it, this as it, and probably this as it too, and we just fill that all up. Also. I completely forgot about the fact that this has been here this whole time. So they should go harvest that all real quick. I was going to say they're actually using some of these because I had a lot more of these before, but then I remembered that I sent some with to just sell. And then swapping so that way all of the the bedrooms are on opposite sides of all of the production rather than having production in some of the bedrooms a large piece of an ancient ship has crashed right by its mysterious influence will kill all plants in an expanding circle around itself destroyed as soon as possible but we wear it would probably defend itself ship part poison What was Bowman just doing? Bunch of on fire elephants. But we're not gonna go destroy it while it's uh, on fire. The fire's doing a whole lot more than the poison is at this point. It's raining currently. Alrighty then. Let's get a redrafted. Epsilon, you don't have a fucking gun. I 
actually yeah, we'll undraft you because you're not even gonna pick this up if I don't. Everybody does have their guns, right? Yeah, for all of the hunting stuff, um, I don't think any of my hunters have, uh, well, they probably at least one of them does, uh, the burst rifles, because there's a, there's a lower chance of animals attacking you if you stay at a very far off distance, and having them use chain shotguns to hunt is not a great thing. Alright, shoot this. Now shoot that. Now shoot that. And now shoot that. Alright, then everybody shoot that together. Now everybody undraft. Blackfell, how are you doing? 14 hours, 20 hours. Let's go ahead and allow all of these. 35 plus steel, an advanced component, a bunch of steel, and then some components. All right, we're good. Fire. Oh, what's well, raining? Tend to Blackfell. Blackfell is fine, right? She's just up and walking. Okay, good, she's fine. Marge, are you tending to... Sienna, is Sienna fine? Sienna, the fuck are you doing? Oh, she's going out to firefight. Do I have any medical beds? I'm gonna swap these to medical. Dowera. So yeah, I don't have anything else to sell. They've got a normal marine helmet, black vest, EMP, bolt action rifle. I think we're good. There you go. Oh, I suppose everyone could see what she's at because I accidentally clicked on nothing rather than seeing her actual health. There you go, get all the psychoid leaves. Also, I like how people that are assigned to hauling will still prioritize merging stacks together over bringing stuff in before it rots. Fucking idiots. Packers and Jen both have tattered apparel. Grab that. Alright, so we need a flak vest and flak pants. Flak vest. Flak pants. Those will get done eventually.
Yeah, he's already put on a... Well, he was wearing a shirt before, but he already put on some pants to cover it. And then, uh, Jen is wearing tattered, but I can't deal with that now. Book goods trader. It's a trade ship. Cool. I usually have a whole lot better shit. Um, let's see. They've got some huskies. What is the training level of a husky? Trainability advanced. I'm not sure why they split the dromedaries with all that stuff. They got a lot of dromedaries. They got some cows. Um, we got a lot of chocolate we can give them. Insect meat, gross, corn, 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 rice, components, advanced camel hide, cloth, camel hair. Light leather, camel hide, chinchilla fur. Um, ambrosia. I'm actually getting close to them being out. I got a lot of beer. I need to start selling beer. Do you have a lot of gold? You got a decent chunk of gold. Is there anything you have that I actually want, though? I suppose if you got an advanced component, I'll take it. And it never hurts to have more regular components. We'll take all of that. Alright, there you go. Um, is this beer going to be way too much then? Oh yeah, it's definitely going to be way too much. <clears throat> Alright, let's try 200. Alright, let's try 300. All right, I think we, we would be good with that. There's nothing else that I want from you guys. I don't need Neutromine. I don't think there's anything else you have that I want. I'm trying to look at all the symbols and see if there's anything I desire, but there's not really anything. I don't really need smoke pot belts. Although, actually, having a smoke pot belt for my guy that uses the Doomsday might be pretty neat. But I'm pretty sure I can make smoke pot belts myself. Prevents turrets from locking on. You know what? Give me a smoke pot belt. I don't know what Excellent is supposed to do for it, because it does the exact same thing no matter what. Alright. Should get dropped in over here. Yeah. So I sold off some of my beer, but he could not take all of it. Well, if I had sold only beer, I could have done that, but no point in getting rid of all of one export and rather just get rid of all the crappy furs that I don't want and then get rid of some other stuff later. Oh yeah, he's disassembling my canoid. Perfect. So I get even more component. And I suppose he's going to do the flak vest and flak pants since he seems to be prioritizing the two scyther things. That's fine, we're at 890 currently. He's about to finish the last marine helmet, so I actually need another 90 plasteel, which uh, will be easily attained from the other ones. All right, yeah, this guy up here is on uranium. I don't need uranium. Just put a power conduit up here, and then get it reselected. Uh, reinstall this up here. Black Belt Sienna are all, are both, uh, recovering. See, because unless I tell them to recover, they'll still prioritize, um, other things before bed rest. So they will firefight patient and doctor. Oh, duh. They'll firefight and doctor before they get bed rest. Unless I have a medical bed, and then they'll go to bed. Actually, I should set um, some other stuff in here. What is it under? For 
furniture. No. Sarah has inspired surgery. And no, you're nobody's gonna let you do surgery, dude. Security furniture. Oh, hospital bed. There we go. Silver hospital bed, steel hospital bed, uranium. Check that right there, and then we'll we'll set this one here. And then deconstruct that. Deconstruct that. I'm assuming these are only used for regular beds, so we're gonna not do that. Um, but then we got the miscellaneous, so we got the hospital bed, and then we want increases medical ten quality, surgery success chance, and immunity gain speed when placed directly adjacent to a hospital bed. Only works for hospital beds. Normal beds will not benefit. Attaching more than one vital monitor to the same bed will have no effect. Hey, more berries. I feel like I get almost no berries and potatoes. Like, by comparison, when I yield my rice, it ends up being way better. Then again, um, the rice field, I believe, is way better size-wise. It definitely is compared to the potatoes. Because rice is supposed to have the lowest yield per square, except it grows faster. And then um, I'm assuming berries and potatoes are supposed to be about the same. Let's actually, you know, while these guys are not really doing anything and they're getting my building and stuff ready to go up there, I'm going to swap over to some Google and uh, check. I'm gonna check food on this and see if there's like a, a stat thing going on. Uh, deterioration rate. What was that? What, what just popped up? Caravan arrived. At, caravan arrived at Zatro. Perfect. Fulfill trade order. Offer 26 tribal wear for uranium plate armor, legendary silver dining chair, excellent and heavy SMG, good. Confirm. And I want to trade with you. So I'm assuming you have all those things now? You don't. That's fine. All right, so the things that you gave me were... Oh, apparently I have fruit on me. Um... Oh, I brought a ton of rhino leather. leather. All right, we're gonna get rid of that. Uranium plate armor, legendary. It's very shit for move speed. Do you have anything that I want? I'll take your gold. No, I owe you money. Um, but do you have anything that I want? Not really. Oh yeah, this is Garrow, so they're not gonna have anything good. Yeah, no, I don't think so. But, um, we'll sell them a crap load of rhino leather. There we go. So now I've got a, a giant ass thing of plate armor. And um, what was the other thing that they gave me? Oh, the silver dining chair. Okay. Go ahead and accept that. And then there's not really anything else like on the way back home, but um, we'll just go ahead and tell her to return home. Maybe a week before she gets back. Alright, then we will deconstruct that bed. Deconstruct that bed, and then miscellaneous vital monitor. Alrighty. So then they actually will be clean rooms, they'll be in hospital beds and they have vital monitors, so those these will be the best places to have surgeries and stuff. What's that noise? Is that you mission? Okay, 
He's making flak pants. He'll be done in a bit. Plasteel is in good shape. We've only got one marine helmet left, and then 980 plasteel that we gotta use up on uh, their stuff. Also, I got rid of a ton of crap, so this doesn't scroll anymore. Mission's got some tattered. What is tattered for you, my good sir? The lizard skin hat. My old man, he doesn't have a hat anymore. That's disappointing. All right, bills. Make a cowboy hat, details. Go complete, make marine helmet, cool. So we've got cloth, camel hair, and elephant leather. Um, make a camel hair cowboy hat. I don't know why you can do that, but do it. Relations with Navron have changed from 68 to 58. Natural time needs to reach 50 over time. That's dumb. Fine, we'll be a lot better off. We probably won't actually stay in that area for very long. Like, we're gonna, after we get up there, we're gonna try to make everybody like us real quick so I can get some assistance when I need it. And then, um, like, if I need immediate military action, I can call that in. And then, um, see, he's just repositioning shit. I mean, there's not stuff to carry down here, but. Harvest Ziambroja. Alright, and then we'll go back up here because this, this is harvestable again too. Is there any of that original Ambrosia sprout left? It's like up here somewhere. I'm not seeing any little Ambrosia plants. This one's got Plasteel. Cool. Jen's not happy about her constant travel. Also, I never sent her with a bedroll, so that's a little bit unfortunate for her. That's right, you guys collect that cloth. At least it's not completely realistic we have to worry about that stuff. All right, let's, let's turn on the smeltery. I've got some slag lying around. Should be some slag up here, yeah. Oh yeah, kibble's over here on the on the butcher thing. Do I need meat? I'm out of meat. All right, shit. Let's let's actually get Let's make a couple of sniper rifles for people that actually do hunting. So it would be Sam, Viking or Pocker and Vector. Or actually no, wait. Vector, Viking, or Pocker. Vector, Viking, or Pocker, and Sam. They all have charge rifles. Let me see sniper rifle. Uh, range is 45. What is the range on a charge rifle? Oh, it's 26. What is the range on... Bolt action rifle. Yeah, uh, details. Thingy. 
It is 37. So it's it's decent. All right, let's make some sniper rifles, and then we'll uh we'll have to swap over Sam Vector Viking Arm Pockers because I don't need people getting attacked by animals. Because if you use a sniper rifle, I'm so far away they won't actually be able to see me. The, the percentage is only based on if they can see you, and if you're really far away, they don't even notice. Well, they get hit and they start running away, but they don't know where you are. All my beer got made up, but I still gotta wait forever for more to grow because they took forever to plant the damn shit. Um, from Nabron, what have they got? They've got an iguana, cobra, cobra. Doo -doo -doo -doo. They've got some advanced components. Um, bionic arm. They've got a long doomsday. Dibs. Uh, they got some gold. Advanced components. And then if I give you the thing that I get. Oh, I don't have, I can't do that, damn it. All right, but Doomsday, Gold, and their advanced components, that'll be good. Also, I think I bought an advanced component so I can go down one more on how much he's making. And then I can actually probably go down another three because she'll be bringing these back. Yeah, that'll work. All right, so let's tell him to make four less advanced components. Research screen. All right, smoke pop belts. Yeah, I can't actually make them though. Platform tubes, auto cannon, flat screen, moisture pump, shield belt. Johnson Tanaka drive. A dromedary is pregnant. A lot of cloth. This storage is pretty much full. Where else can I tell them to shove this shit? I've got a lot of wood. Where the fuck am I still getting so much wood from? I suppose I'm not hardly using any of it. Put a bridge over all of this. And then over all of this. It's a lot of fucking wood. I'm assuming bridges are really fast to build. I'm just gonna shove a bridge right there. We'll see how that works out. I'm just bored and I want to use up some of this wood because it's in the way. Bowman is supposed to be getting with Pockers, right? And then um, Cody and Sam are supposed to be trying to get together. And then ex wife Skylorn faction leader. I'd like to find Sky and murder her. I could probably Google that how to look up specific people. Anyway, um, I'm gonna alt tab back over to the wiki. Sources, raw food, degradation, growing zones. Maybe it's under that. 
because all the other stuff gave me was just like destruction of crap. It's a very ineffective growing zone right there. Oh, wait. Oh, okay. So apparently, I'm looking at a picture right now, and this person's got, like, cotton growing across, like, this giant thing. It looks really fucking stupid, but it's surrounded by rocks. So fire can't spread to the cotton. They've got a, a two-line layer of uh, rocks and, like, slag and stuff that just go around the entire thing. That's actually, that, that's a good idea. Um, I don't need to actually see growing zone, that's dumb. Take me back. I want to see... Let's go to resources menu. Oh, this wiki isn't even complete. It doesn't even have a description for raw fungus. Oh, there's a lot of egg items listed up here. I want to see, like, the max yield per square and how long they take to grow, damn it. Maybe it's in plants. Growth rate factors, fertility. Okay, here we go. Uh, rich soil is 140%. Hydroponics is 230%. Temperature uh, requires temperature between 10 Celsius, 50 degrees Fahrenheit, and 42 Celsius, 107.6. Um, plant rate growth drops by 10% for each degree Celsius below 10 and 6.25 for every degree above so it's worse to be cold than hot we knew that uh, require 51% decorative plants typically require at least 30% yeah because they can be inside rest all plants rest from hour 19 through 5 more accurately plants rest for the 11th of the day leaving 13 hours for growing uh, instant growth all growth receive an instantaneous growth of 5% when sowed slash planted this is relevant because it means that all plants only need to grow 95% from the moment they are planted to become fully grown 100% you'll see shown blah blah actual growth time um, growth remaining multiplied by 60,000 ticks a day times the number of growth days divided by the growing ticks per day GRF F GRF F GRF L what? Lifespan. All right, this is what I wanted to see. Grow days. <laughs> oh, because it's a panther that's hunting it. Whatever. They're going to keep doing their building stuff down there. This is what I wanted to see. Um. So, let's see. Smoke leaf, strawberry plant. Strawberry plant. Oh, this is nutrition per day on how much it grows. Okay. Um, so, corn plant is better overall, but it takes forever to grow. So, the growth rate of a rice plant is three. It takes three days to grow rice. And it takes 11.3 days to grow corn, 22.5 days to grow devil strand. Um... Your root is 6.5, hot plant is 5, potato plant is 5.8, strawberry plant is 4.62. Um, the yield of the foods for all of them, because they, uh, they're about the same. So hydroponics almost doubles the nutrition per day, because it's uh, 230. Actually, it would more than double it, because it's 230 versus the regular 100%. And of course, if you were in um, very fertile soil, it wouldn't matter. So fertility sensitivity, I'm guessing that means that some plants don't need fertile soil. Looks like corn and devil strand don't really, but potatoes really do. Or maybe potatoes really don't, the other ones really do. I don't know. Um, wild plants, trees, beauty base. Oh, some trees actually make things beautiful. All right, but um, so it's 11.3 days to grow corn. It's three days to grow rice. 
and the the harvest yield for rice is seven the harvest yield for corn is 27 and they're about the same level of nutrition so if you want to grow your food really fast rice if you want to grow a smaller crop corn so like this right here um let's see so th this is Corn yields almost four times as much, and it takes almost four times as much to grow. They're almost the same, except corn is slightly better in terms of uh, the number of days to grow and how much they, they yield. So what is the size of this crop right here? So this is a six by one, two, three, one, two, three, nine, 12, 15, 17. So this is a six by 17. I don't have a calculator up. So six by 17 down here. And then this is a, I can't even count from these fucking things. There's like an eight by whatever. This is an eight by 18 and this is a six by 17. Let's go here and look real quick. Eight times. 18 is 144 and then so that would be 144 oh I should multiply this again um, times 7 is 1008 and then 6 by 17 by 27. So 1,088 and then 2,754. So yeah, corn is way better, except it takes forever to grow. So if you're in a year round growing, corn is absolutely the best food for you. But if you're looking at like fitting in as much growing as possible in a short period of time, rice is going to be probably what's best. And I haven't had to worry about growing seasons in this. Um, usually when i would play before and i would play in a temperate area you know like the typical you have like a fairly short winter it would be um like two crops of normal crops like potatoes and uh, strawberry plants you guys having fun so yeah if you need to like um if you want to grow a lot, you just do this. So I think I'm actually going to go ahead and swap this rice over to corn. At least it's walk speed 100. It's like twice as bad. Um, it's just a shield belt. It's got to be pretty close if I'm going to go get it. It's not that far away. It's like a day of travel for a shield belt. <laughs> if we just form a caravan real quick, we'll just send somebody to go get it. Somebody who's not really doing a whole lot. Um, Debbie, hey, what's up? You're going to go get a shield belt for me, okay? Um... send you with five days of food choose the route right there choose the route. send you with 10 days of food except all right debbie's just gonna go get the shield belt real quick yeah, i almost didn't even get that trade done in time but when i manage to sell that armor it'll be really nice Got a bunch more beer still made up. Hops are starting to grow all right. Debbie's caravan is formed, is now traveling on the world map. Yeah, she really just had to go collect some meals and then leave. Oh, mission, hey. Wait, what are you set to 
Where then? Mission is set for worker. Oh, he's wearing a female hat. That's why it says force. Sir and Viking are no longer inspired. Cool, I don't care. Oh yeah, we got tons of space down here now. Yeah, I think I'm going to get rid of all that rice and put corn there. So now this is going to harvest me more about 4,000 food when it's all grown. So rice is more of like a constant keep up type item. You're, you're going to have somebody down here growing it and bringing it up like every few days. And then, um, you know, you, you'll be able to squeeze more harvests out of a period of time. And let's say you, you get close like 90 percent on i think that's why they have that um like period of percentage of after it's actually like you know grown a little bit you can harvest it before it gets to 100 and you don't get a penalty for it so you can tell your people to go get your corn and then throw some rice in there for just a little bit because you might be like one week off of it getting too cold for the stuff to grow So if you've got like five days left before winter hits, you want to cut down your, your corn at like 90% and then check up some rice. Unless you're, you know, stocked for the winter. Combat supplier from Nabron. Cool. Jen isn't back yet, unfortunately. I don't have that shield belt yet, but I can probably buy slash sell some stuff. How are we doing with these sniper rifles? Sam's going to equip a sniper rifle. Vector's going to come equip a sniper rifle. And then Mission's got two left to make, right? Yeah. So do Sam and Vector and then uh, Viking or Pockers. And then I could probably just give the charge rifles to a couple other people. So we'd be a little bit more effective at a distance. Trade with Rick. Oh yeah, these guys are from Navaron, right? Kate. Is there a Kate here? No. Actually, I could... If people from Navaron are nearby, I can always just go to social and click on her. And it says she's off the map. Alrighty then. So we've got chain shotgun, charge rifle, we've got medicine. Anything you have that I want? Oh, the marine helmets are we selling to him. Um, shield belt, flak vest. You don't really have a whole lot, but all right. Well, I suppose I just accept the small payment then. Alrighty. So yeah, if we get some people that had chain shotguns, and instead just give them the charge rifles, that would be good. Actually, mission real quick. Go back to using a chain shotgun. I want Bowman and Sienna to have the charge rifles. Just because they were my backup people anyway. Vector and Pockers are idle. You don't feel like making kibble? We don't have any meat. I think it's dumb that that requires meat. Alright, but we got we got some snipe rifles in our people now. Is that still that same one? 
All right, here we'll take Vector and Pockers. Oh no, we'll take Vikinger and Pockers off because it's Vector and Sam that have the. Oh shit, no. Crap, you guys keep cooking. Um, we'll take Vikinger and Pockers off of hunting, and then it'll be Vector and Sam hunting, and we'll uh, order some hunts on some wild boar and tortoise and monkey and all the rest of these. All right. Yeah, we're a little bit lower on wood, but I'm gonna order them to do, to finish off the rest of this bridge. I don't see a reason why that can't happen. Although if there's a fire, this is totally just all gonna burn. Yeah, when we get to where we're going, we're probably going to dig into the mountain and get situated inside. I'll probably end up setting up hydroponics and stuff like that and try to make it so we don't have to go outside at all. So I think what I'm gonna end up doing is I'm gonna set up a ton of rice inside and make sure that that's um, going to keep my people fed, like get enough of it so it's everybody's fed. And then, um, then add more to it to swap over to corn and then once everything is ready to grow and everything will be fine and um oh yeah that's right if you're not down in the tropics rather than in heat waves you can get cold snaps and those will definitely kill crops but um if you're up inside a mountain and you got everything all done up in there you'll be fine so ultimately what I would want to do is I would want to like dig into a place, make it my base, and then have just turrets and everything outside with my starship nearby. And starships are not small at all. Um, like I was looking at this, this is not even the big part. Like, no, that's not the big part either. This is the big part, the ship reactor. And actually I have supplies enough for that, right? I would just need more advanced components. Also, I think they might have reduced it since I saw that wiki thing that was like, you need like 60 something of them. Cause there's eight here, four here, that's 12, 15 here, another one for that, so that's 16. So unless the warp drive and the starflight sensors are like another 40, I'd say that's probably inaccurate. Did you shoot my fucking geothermal generator, damn it? Are you getting better at shooting by doing this? I hope so. I mean, they're safe, at least. They're not gonna get attacked, but Jesus. I think that might be too far. Panther 4 is miscarried due to starvation. Mm. Fucking bullshit. Caravan arrived at the Adam Stash. Just doomsday the elephants. All right, well, we got the item stash. Reform. Items, anything you want to bring with? She's got some berries. Choose root. That, choose root. Accept. All right, she's on her way. There's an eclipse, so shit is powering down. That's not cool. Let's 
Too bad you can't prioritize your temperature stuff over everything else. First black and code, you're kicking ass. They do two in the time it takes Sienna to do one. Can you make a bridge that isn't made out of wood? No. Back to your disappointment to your mother and I. Well, at least he hit it. It's going to bleed out eventually. Death in two hours. He's going to fire at it for another two hours before it dies of blood loss. I'm just going to go execute it. Alright, maybe the sniper rifles is a little overkill. Actually, underkill because they're fucking shit. Did he finish another one? Nah, I cancel the sniper rifles. Why are these fizzling if there's an eclipse? I suppose it wouldn't have been bad to uh, set up. Actually, that would be a pretty good idea. Find a way to run um, a single geothermal through all of my temperature control items. At least Kenta can still research. Pretty sure my heaters are still up and running. Oh, that one isn't. But I mean, it's not that cold out outside anyway. Caravan from Nabaron. Alright, I got berries and stuff. I've got advanced components. I've got the uranium plate armor. So if you got something you want to give me, that'd be cool. Dark cloth. Um, anything you have that I want? Not really. So I mean, I can't even give you the plate armor. But we can go ahead and give you the silver dining chair. All right, she's not that far out now. He's got some more advanced components to make. A lot of them. Anyway, there's our bridge built. The eclipse is ending. Then again, corn also is higher risk just based off the fact that it getting hit by a blight is way more devastating than rice being hit by a blight because you've got three days of recovery versus almost 11. Actually, it's almost 12, but... Assuming it gets that extra 5% anyway, you don't even have to worry about that too much. Vector and Jen. Vector's got some tattered apparel apparently caravan ambushed not cool bro what is this at oh it's fine so we need another flak jacket and flak pants flak jacket and flak pants oh no we've been ambushed oh shit it's debbie that's ambushed Well, they can't go through my shield belt, so. Actually, I probably should have told her to take that off before the fight started.
Debbie's about to get herself fucking killed. <laughs> Debbie just died. Alright, that's funny. Yeah, if she would have had the shield belt, she might have actually survived that, because she could have gotten some shots off. Alrighty then. Looks like my psychoid's almost grown. Got my hops and corn. Sam's on a shoot frenzy. I want to finish sniper. I want to cancel that. It's going to become components and steel now. Right, Pockers, you need your flak pants and your flak vest. And then Vector still has his uh, flak pants. Wait, where is he at? Ah, crap. Where was it when I told him to take his flag jacket off? <clears throat> ah, crap. I got no clue. I'm looking for a flag jacket. There it is. Oh, we seriously cleared out my wood stores. Caravan from Nabaron. Mm, do you have anything that I want, though? Looks like all I got is drugs. Alright, let's move on. Actually, wait. Let's trade. Want some gifts? I don't think we give two sides money. Oh, well. move on. She'll be back soon. Hopefully, she doesn't get ambushed by that same douchebag. I know, because the other one was over here somewhere. Oh, okay. Yeah, duh. I was looking at the wrong person when I went to the map. I don't know why one single corn plant is way more grown than the rest of them. The Ambrose is going to be ready to be harvested again soon. Oh, this Ambrose sprout's gone. I forgot how cute they are when they're wearing the little flak vests. Yeah, we seriously need to get some of the psychoid dealt with. And the hops is all growing. Flak pants complete. Vector. Wait, I already had another flak jacket? Whatever. The other tattered apparel is Jen, and she'll be back soon. Epsilon, you need to stop fucking complaining the whole damn time. Colonists banished to death. We banished someone in such a way that there's almost no way they'll survive. Oh wait, so you can banish somebody with, like, good supplies on them, and people won't be pissed off about it? Epsilon and Marge are fighting it again. Well, Epsilon got fucked up. 
caravan ambushed by manhunters. Why does it say rooster? There's a manhunting rooster off on the coast. Okay. <laughs> it's coming for me. Oh no. All right, Jen. Let's go ahead and form caravan again. Oh no! Wait, shit! Here, reform caravan. There we go. Items. Um, go ahead and bring back the rooster. Might as well. Except. All right. So she'll be back in 1.4 days. She can go ahead and bring back the rooster with her. I'm like a bit of chicken on the way back. <clears throat> Yeah, I should do the. I should download the the mod that allows you to repick all of the items and stuff that you can bring with, and I'll give people traits that make them like super fucked up, make them like psychopathic cannibals and stuff. Otherwise, you just kind of get lucky with that type of thing, and I'll make it so that they they don't like doing drugs or anything like that, if I can, because you can only pick three traits, unfortunately. Where are my traits? I never realized that Kenta is, is jealous. Uh, enemy outpost guarded by four enemies. Relations will improve, and they'll send us a reward. All right, where is that? It's not that far away. It's on the river. Alliance of Gera wants this destroyed. Reward Psychic Emanator of Construction... Psychic Emanator and Construction Neural Trainer Mech Serum. Known threat, outpost four enemies. We could definitely take them. Let's uh, set up a caravan, have them move in. Right, we're going to get you guys back to using charge rifles again. Chain shotgun. Chain shotgun. We'll just sell the sniper rifles. I don't really have much of a use for them. The charge rifles are fine for distance, as long as no people with chain shotguns are sent to hunt. Alright, let's go ahead and form a caravan, and get some people killed off. Alright, so there's four enemies there. We're going to bring Bowman, Sienna, Cody, Sam, and Pockers. And we'll send them with 50 surviving meals. Sounds good. No, no. We'll send them with 100. 13.2 days of food. Um, what else? We're definitely going to send them with some medicine. Actually, just in case there's more injuries, we'll send them with 20 medicine. And then what else? What else? Do you want to send them with anything else? I think they'd be good. Yeah, that'd be fine. 1.7 days, they got 13 days of food. They're fine. Oh, yeah, Bowman and Pockers is supposed to be getting on. And then, um,. Cody and Sam, too. Yeah, so we've got, like, the Lovebirds and Sienna along for the ride. It'd be interesting if at one point somebody was like, Hey, um, Kate is being kidnapped by somebody and I could, like, rescue them. A bit like what happened with Georgette. God, it's been, it's been so long since Georgette. <clears throat> when Jen gets back, we'll have over 10,000 silver again. I'd like to have a good stock of it. Also, I picked up a Doomsday, didn't I? Um, Jen's got a Doomsday, doesn't she? She's got a Doomsday. And 12 Elephant Tusks. I guess she didn't sell those. Any camp quests going on that. I should go to the 
world. So she'll be back at about the same time that they'll get. Actually, it'd take them longer because they don't have the road. But I noticed that being on the road, you get encountered a whole lot more. Yeah, this would be where I want to be. And then actually, there'll be two very short roads to places that I want to go. And this actually is just like four blocks away. So it'd be a good thing being friends with Nabron. So I'm trying to think um, the different playthroughs that I want to do. I want to do one specifically for <sighs> the Savage Tribe of like five people. And I want to have them just move along the whole time. And then um, I want to have another one that is uh, probably super advanced and like just the way that I want my people to survive and just give them traits that allow them to do that. So making them, maybe not cannibals, but um, psychopaths and then like um, just default really happy. I think it's like sanguine makes them really happy all the time. It's like sanguine psychopaths. So that way they just, they're perfectly fine with murdering people and taking their organs and shit we just become like organ merchants we just go and hunt people down and then bring their guts and sell them be like an underground type thing i'm not sure i'm going to want to play that very soon i'm definitely going to need the the tribesmen in the way of that Yeah, we got way too many psychoid leaves and not enough yayo. People aren't making my drugs enough. Rare thrombos! Tame! Aw, oh, fuck. Sam's not here. Fucking save. Overwrite. Draft! Come kill the thrombo! Sam is not here. She won't be here for a while. It'll leave before she gets here. Oops. Attack the thrombo. Got it. Owned. You didn't have a chance, kid. I wonder how much meat I'm going to get from killing one thrombo. Can I tell you this? <clears throat> It'd have to be assigned. I could, of course, assign everybody to everything and then um, go more for priority for the manual. Actually, you know, we could do that. We could set them up for priority instead. So everything defaults to three. All right, so if we say, firefighting is a one, doctoring is a one, um, patient as a two for everybody. Rest in bed to recuperate from not immediately life-threatening medical problems. Uh, we'll set this to four. I know we'll keep that at a three, I think, for now. Um, Again, if I don't want other people doing it, I will still just have these guys set to it. Um, warden as a one. So if I have a one for every person, that's going to be the thing that they do. So research and warden. Vector is warden. We'll set a two to cook. 
and a two to hunt. Or maybe I'll set this as three. Release prisoners, flick switches, and machines. Um, we'll set everybody as a two for these. Warden, three is perfectly fine for her. Um, I want her to haul and clean more. Marge, be research two, clean three. Nah, we'll leave that where it is because she'll clean instead then. And she'll handle before she cleans and researches because it's just this way naturally. Um, even if they, if they still are the same. So they'll go this way for all the ones, this way for all the twos, this way for all the threes. Then we'll do black bell set to grow as your one priority. So firefight, doctor, grow, basic, and then on and on. Um, Kento's research and warden right away. Uh, mission is Smith, Taylor, Craft right away. Uh, haul, clean, everything else. So let's see, somebody who's set to mining more. We'll set Epsilon as a two for that. Let's go ahead and unpause everything. Uh, plant cut. Black Bell is going to be a one for grow, one for plant cut. A two for construct, a two for mine, a three for everything else. Um, actually, we'll set hall and clean above smith and craft. Uh, Epsilon, I want to have you as a one for craft, nothing for Taylor. Uh, Smith can go ahead and be a three. So she she will craft my drugs, and then she'll keep moving on to other things. Um, Blackfell is set to Smith and craft at three. So after she's grown, plant, cut, constructed, mined, hauled, and cleaned, she'll do that stuff. She'll, she'll, she'll pretty much never Smith or craft unless she's really, really bored. Um, Jen is back. All right, so Jen is an, a decent doctor, so we'll set her doctor three. Um, we're gonna have her handle as one, grow and plant cut as two, construct and minus three, and then haul and clean. There's not really a point in having a four unless I wanna set hauling clean to four and have a different three underneath. Caravan is back. Welcome back, Jen. So I've got doctors, I've got wardens, I've got handlers. Um, I'm going to set Marge to handle and then not nah, we'll leave that there. Um, so we've got two people that handle actually we'll set cooking to one and then handling to two and handling to two over here mission is going to be constantly doing other stuff anyway so having mission as a two is perfectly fine um, we've got two cooks we've got hunters actually I shouldn't have them handle Because Marge and Jen are handling just fine. I'm going to set them handle, but I'm going to set it to three. So that way they'll hunt before they do that. <clears throat> We've got two constructors, except Jen will handle, grow, and plant cut first. Same with Black Fell. Um, it'll be fine. Jen is on a food binge. She was in minor pain. Uh, grow, Blackfell is set to one, Epsilon is three, she'll mine first. Um, well actually, let's set this to two. Minor break risk, Epsilon, fuck you. Grow, Blackfell is set, Jen is set. Jen will do that after she's done handling. Mining, Blackfell and Epsilon will. 
Epsilon will do that naturally after crafting, so she won't. Um, <clears throat> let's set Sarah to mine after hauling and cleaning. This is an issue. I need my people to get back so I can set more stuff. <clears throat> uh, mission is going to Smith, Taylor, and Craft. It's perfectly fine. He does a great job with all of that anyway. Um, Epsilon is set to Craft, so she's going to do my drugs and shit. And then... Uh, hauling and cleaning and Kent is researching, so you know, we won't worry about it. Um, actually, wait. Oh, they're there. All right, we're paused, good. Work, where is Sir? Sir is my hauler and cleaner. Caravan arrived at the outpost. Jumped location, so they got Larry, Nick. All, right, all you guys have charge rifles, correct? Except for Sienna and Bowman. They don't even have any turrets. Oh no, they do. Ma'am, you're gonna die. Shoot Nick. Why the fuck are you running over there to then shoot him? Let's go architect, furniture, sleeping spot here. Designate for prison. Oh, duh. All right, let's claim this. And we'll send our guys to go stand over by it. Actually, shit, stand here, go here. Take that thing down. Perfect. Now go inside. Alright, undraft everybody. Claim, 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 because I've got five people. Architect structure. Door. door. I can't even select it. Fuck, motherfucker. Who is assigned to plant cutting? Damn it. Oh my fuck. Cut. Mm. Alright, fine. You guys aren't assigned to plant cut. Pockers is. Pockers. Plant cut, damn it. What are these? Oh, it's just a bunch of wooden weapons. How long until she dies? Four hours. Not great. Not great. You know what? Let's set this to prisoners. Capture ma'am. Do I have anybody set to doctor? We'll set Cody to doctor. Cody! Tend. <clears throat> also, didn't even have anybody drop the medicine. Oh, it's just a bruise. Quest completed. Alrighty then. Let's go to world. 
tell these guys to reform. We're taking that person with us. Um, actually, let me let me look at her real quick. Um, bio. She's an undergrounder. She's gay. And she's nervous. Mental break threshold. <clears throat> How is her health? Um, doesn't seem like there's any issues with her. She's incapable of none. <clears throat> she's got mining and plants. And I like her because her name is Ma'am. How old is she? Life expectancy is 80. Where is her age? Hang on. Let me zoom in real quick. How old are you? You are 32. We've got a 32-year-old lesbian that we captured. Well, it's your lucky day, because I'm not in the mood of killing people right now, so good for you. Uh, components. There's some more berries, I guess. We'll take all the berries. Take all the packet survival meals for sure. They had go juice. We'll take that. Uh, Nick is just some dead dude. <clears throat> okay, we will take the auto pistol, the revolver. I still got space for more weight. We can take some weapons. There we go. We'll just take all the weapons. All right, choose route. Let's do the butte. Four days. Zoom in. We're good to go. Dan's down doing plant stuffs. Apparently that door needs to be repaired. Major break risk. Sienna is throwing a fit about something. What is she throwing a fit about? Manipulation weakened. I can't see her needs. I'm not sure why she's at a major break risk. Also, this is going to need to be expanded or something. I've got way too much shit up here. I've got so much psychoid, nobody's using it. I need to set somebody else to craft. I need a third person crafting. So Epsilon and Mission are set to craft. So Epsilon is going to make my drugs first before she does anything else. Um, firefight to one, Doctor to two. Handle is set to one. So she's going to handle stuff first. She grow after. And she'll haul and clean. I need somebody else to get in here and start crafting because stuff's annoying. All right, Vector, um, this is cooking. The brewing is cooking, so I need somebody else set to cook. Oh, Pac is just set to cook, but he's not back yet. Let's actually, let's set Blackfell to construct first, because then she'll go and repair shit that needs to be repaired. Trained rescue. Oh yeah, let's let's check my animals. What else do I have to train? I can, I can train panthers, and I can train my little arctic wolf puppies. I've got four arctic wolf puppies. They're fucking awesome. All right. Um, drum dairies are all set to Blackfell. Polar bear and geisha are both set to Gen. Just do this, that way I don't have to worry about doing it later. I'm perfectly fine with them following around. 
have all these animals just following Jen constantly. All right, so we got to train um, four Arctic wolves and another panther. Got lots of animals. Look at all the little Arctic wolf puppies. They're all so, so cute. Why the fuck is this just sitting outside? Psychic emanator. An ancient device that projects soothing psychic fields around itself. This improves the mood of anywhere nearby. Works through walls. Oh, that's cool. Who do I want to improve all the moods of, though? People over here? Where's the most effective place to put this? Shove it up in the rec room. Yeah, fuck it. We're going to put it right here. Right next to the, the statue. Got a psychic suit emanator. I'll set it to allow. That way they'll actually come and do it. Um, I need some more meat. We've got wild boars set to be killed. Boomalopes, boomalopes, rhinoceros, elephant. Four point eight days. Why? Final straw was being dis depressive. Oh, so she's just delaying them at this point. Ma'am is no longer incapable of walking. Oh, maybe that would help too. Yeah, that definitely helped. All right, we're gonna have to set these two uh, prisoners. I can also turn off medical. So we set this to prisoner medical and that one's just prisoner. Actually, you know what? We'll set this one to just regular medical, and we'll set this one to prisoner. Because the only the only thing designating it as medical does is makes it so that uh, they go to that bed for surgeries and bed rest. Otherwise, you can use them like regular beds. But they don't gain a bonus from other things. Look at all the little Arctic wolf puppies. Pork. I didn't even get to see where all my thrombo meat went. They used it up right away. I've only got simple meals. Oh yeah, because they're making my package survival meals because I took a bunch of them. Still got sandbags from when these idiots tried to come make some stuff. I'm going to claim that as mine. And uh, uninstall it so I can go pick it up. What is that? That's a dead chinchilla. I suppose if you wanted to, you could actually, like, why does that not have power? Weird. I'll put the little thing a little closer. 15 more advanced components, and then he's only got the armor left. Takes forever to get the shit done. So I got the seven helmets. There's my uranium plate armor legendary. Oh, it's insulation against the cold and it's based off of Fahrenheit, is it? Insulation against cold. How 
much as peril and prisoners when we come from temperature grade the value greater values allow surviving in colder temperatures material effect multiplier 26 percent double strand insulation gets cold to 7.6 Here's my thrombo horn. People are looking at me, Machi, you killed a thrombo. Oh, that's mission making that noise. Because he's machining that stuff. You know, I'm gonna order some wood chopped up here. And I'm going to order this stuff mined out. I don't know if anyone's even bothered doing that. I don't know if you have any orders for that set very high. Mining is Epsilon and Blackfell. Blackfell is after construction. And Epsilon is after crafting, so it's not going to be done. Because Blackfell's busy with plants. Sienna's no longer wandering in sadness. Wait, can we get the fuck to our place? The only good thing is that after they're done wandering around in a daze, they feel better. How is your plants not higher than this? a lot of hops and I've got a lot of psychoid. If I could get those reduced, that would be great. Because these should be taking up one-fifth and these should be taking up one-eighth. Mm. Monkey, self-tame, Parker's caravan met with the court of Doera. He can't talk properly because of poor health. It's because he's got the uh, uh, joy thing inside. Uh, Timberwolf. Do you have anything that I want, though? Gold. Steel, grand sculpture, normal. Oh, yeah, it looks like my original sculpture thing. Pain stopper. A brain implant which inhibits nociception or pain sensation. Pucker! I've got something else for you, buddy. Um, they've got some advanced components. Oh, I don't have anything to trade them. Damn it. Yeah, I can't make that trade. Unless I want to get them pissed off at me. Yeah, no, I can't even take the, the pain stopper. Damn it! Alright. From now on, send at least 2,000 with people. Damn it. Monkey self tamed. Slaughter. I don't need a fucking monkey. Get out of here. I'm just gonna get eaten by a wild cougar or something anyway. Kent is almost done with his next research project. Look at all my silver, my silver, my silver. It is so awesome. Huh. forever for corn to grow damn but I still have a lot of it laying around so 
Let's say no way he only dropped off like 20. Actually, I'd love to see Jen try to take these guys all on. That'd be, I think that'd be cool. Jen, draft. Let's make sure that you got all of the animals that you should have assigned to you, assigned to you. Um, looks like it. Don't need the dromedaries. She's got everything else, though. All right, Jen. Come on out here. Let's, actually, I'm going to save real quick. Because it's going to go back to this exact spot. I'm just going to undraft her and send everybody else. All right. Jen, come out here. Bring your animals with you. Honest needs treatment. Sir? Oh, shit. Sir was out there. Damn. Um, Blackfell. Go rescue sir. I didn't even notice he was out there. Hold on just a second, Blackfell. Come out around this way. Release animals. Go get them, animals. Jen, run. Blackfell, go rescue, sir. Rescue Panther. I can't have done researching. He's like, hey guys, I got it. Research. Sir might die because of how far away he is. Marjo, rescue Panther. Panther. Alright, that's all the Panthers dead. Or captured. Where's Blackfell? Alright, here we go, sir. This is where I save your life, you dummy. I'm gonna take this medical. You rest until healed. Blackfell. Undraft. No, no, here. Oh, that's no medical treatment. I'm stupid. This is no medicine. Tend to him. You gotta do some field dressings, because otherwise he's gonna bleed to death. You don't have the five hours to walk back and then deal with it later. You gotta tend to him now. Alright. Now we will deconstruct that and Sir can get his stuff and walk back. Well, you should equip that. Don't just leave it there. Oh. Okay, 
Fun fact, you can't just capture them and bring them back because they will uh, have issues. All right, well, all my animals are going to be 10 to 2 then. All right, so I'm currently good on Plasteel. We're actually, we've got as much as we needed. So let's go ahead and set some stuff to deconstruct then, right? That's not even gaining power for some reason. So I'm not going to worry about it. We're going to deconstruct that drill. We're going to deconstruct this drill. Deconstruct this drill. All right. So we'll, uh, once the Arctic Wolves are trained up, that'll be great. Because we've got plenty of Panthers, and then we've got a few Cougars. Cougar 2. It was sleeping outside. Oh, it's, malnu it's malnourished. Who the fuck isn't butchering shit? Give can be made without meat, right? Why is kibble not being made? I'm going to set the zones. Expand a lot of area. Yeah, we'll expand that. Nicole's awake, I can hear uh, the TV on in the other room. Alright, we'll set this all as a loud area. Inspired surgery, Viking. Panther 2 is fully healed, Cougar's having some issues though. We need meat. You guys want to do a better job at hunting, please? Before I have to draft everyone to go kick ass again. Why has Jen not been healed yet? Oh, now she's going to go wait. There's a mad monkey. Wait, can you want to go kill that thing real quick? Thank you. <laughs> They're all hanging out inside. He's like, hang on, I hear something. Walks outside. <laughs> all right, let's go back inside. Caravan is back. Sweet, let's make sure we got some work um, in the proper spot for everybody. All right, so doctoring. We'll set this as two. We will set hauling and cleaning as one. Um, basic everything as two for everyone. All right, Marjo the scientist will clean and then research after doctoring and handling. Uh, Bowman can handle, I suppose. Um, hunt as well. Grow is fine. She'll plant cut too. All right, so let's see here. We got hunters. Uh, Pockers needs to be better at cooking. Sam needs to be set to cook more. So Sam will handle, cook, hunt. And then we've got cook hunt cook he'll hunt but he's not gonna do it right away he'll cook first um anybody else that just came back that i want to set to do crafting uh blackfell and sam are both set to crafting but they're probably not going to do it 
need somebody else to craft. Sienna is set to mine. It's like crafting to two. Three, or actually no. This is hunt, grow, plant, cut. Let's set crafting to none. We'll set Bowman to craft first before she does anything else. So she should intellectual and crafting four. Intellectual. So she needs a little bit higher crafting and then she can make medicine. And Epsilon is intellectual and crafting so she can make medicine too. So if Bowman wants, she can come do watching television right now so Bowman will make drugs Epsilon will make medicine Kent will research ma'am prisoner reduce resistance gear apparently she's got components and berries on her Um, can I order her to be stripped? Strip ma'am, reserved by Marge. Okay, Marge is gonna go to strip her then. There we go. How's she feeling? Serious pain, somewhat impressive dining room, impressive prison cell, spacious interior, high expectations, extremely comfortable. Damn right you're my extremely comfortable prisoner. Let's put a sterile tile here. Panther 3 is no longer capable of walking. Slaughter those panthers. Why is nobody butchering? What is Butcher set as? It's got to be cooking, right? We've got four cooks. We've got Pockers, Vector, Vikinger, and Sam. So we're going to have one person making beer, one person butchering, and then both people running the stoves. Then we've got Bowman making drugs, Epsilon making medicine, Mission crafting everything else. Kent is researching. Is there anything else that I'm missing here? Cody is set to do that. What else is Cody set to do? Uh, Cody will art first before everything, and then construct, and then doctor. Oh, mining is happening. Oh, it's just a psychic drone. It sounded way more sinister than that. making these bedrooms slightly more impressive. Can I order all these chunks hauled? Thank you. Who's got tattered apparel? Jen and Epsilon. Jen. Uh, that is tattered. And that is tattered. Allow, allow. Oh yeah, needs. Um, there should be that psychic drone, right? Or the low psychic drone. Psychic emanator sooth five. Right, and then Epsilon still has some tattered apparel. What are you wearing that's tattered? Um, your cloth jacket. And then your other thing is almost tattered. Where did you just take that cloth jacket off at? Oh, in here. She moved pretty far. Do I have another lesbian?
Night Owl and a fast learner. It's funny that he's a fast learner, but he doesn't do anything. He's he's 20, and he's got so much potential, and I just have him hauling and cleaning. I mean, that's how it goes, honestly. 20-year-olds, nobody respects him. Annoying voice, greedy, greedy depressive. I've got a lot of greedy and, like, jealous people. Nimble, quick sleeper. Oh, that's how she gets up so early in the morning all the time. She's nimble. Melee dodge chance increase. Cool. And then Sarah is sanguine, but she's also greedy. Let's see that. Um, sanguine is 12. And then... Oh, she's got a slightly impressive pregnant, so she's not mad. I gotta figure out what the fuck I'm gonna do with all this claw. It's not really being used up too much. And I've got more hops coming in, but I've got no place to fucking store any of it. All right, let's let's make a caravan. We've got to get some of the shit out of here. All right, so we will take Jen, and we will give her. Oops, people and animals. Here we go. We'll give her a geisha. Dromedaries and panthers. Um. Loyal, is apparently the name of one of mine. Uh, Yulian, who are you bonded to, Sam? Uh, let's see, we'll send her with... We're not going to take the pregnant dromedaries, no. We'll take the, the other ones. So we're going to send her with an elephant and two dromedaries. Let's send her with chocolate. And... A shitload of corn. Let's actually send her with some real food, then. Uh, let's send her with 50 package surviving meals. Uh, components, advanced components, cloth. She can take a thousand cloth. Uh, we'll send her with the pig skin, the light leather, the blue fur, the panthera fur, the thrombo fur. Send her with 10 herbal medicine. Uh, she can take the ambrosia, the yayo, the go juice. Uh, let's set her to take a thousand psychoid leaves. Uh, the elephant tusks, the thrombo horn, steel clubs, the maces and everything, auto pistol revolver. Uh, we'll take the two snipe rifles. And then we'll take the uranium plate armor and 2,500 silver. Sounds good. Choose root. Navaron. Alright, so we'll see if when we get to Navaron we can... Uh, get rid of as much of the stuff that will actually rot, although it's not going to rot very quickly. We'll see if we can ditch the rotting, the rot possible stuff, and then um, after that, then we will head up north if we can't get rid of everything. Alright, so that'll be, that'll be good. She's going to collect up stuff from everywhere, essentially. She's gonna come take some stuff from over here, all of the weapons and stuff that we brought back, the the maces and everything. And then oh shit, did I tell her to bring beer? How do I change the caravan? She doesn't have any beer. Oh, he won't drink beer at all. This is so tedious. I don't know how I missed bringing beer. All right, 
right, I took a bunch of beer. Ma'am is fully healed. I can add her to caravan. I'll have to keep that in mind later. Ma'am crumpled due to a gunshot wound. Kenta promised honesty to Ma'am and asked her to join. Kenta encouraged Ma'am to find common ground around his eloquence. Kenta encouraged Ma'am to talk about the future. Kenta described joining the colony to Ma'am. Kenta offered a chance for Ma'am to talk about meeting new people. Kenta asked Ma'am about her judgment. Kenta told Ma'am about his friends, told a story about friends. I'm just bored, so I'm reading all that stuff. Probably set some boom to hunt. Sir, are you all right? got sir and ma'am oh well ma'am is still a prisoner but i will have ma'am unfortunately she is a lesbian so sir and ma'am can't be together which is that's that would have been a cute couple sir ma'am all right i want to order this to be harvested real quick this is 74 percent grown i want to see if it still yields 27 or close to it if I can just harvest stuff at this rate and cut myself a couple days short without too much issue. Oh, don't give me 17. Gross. Alright, yeah, we'll let it grow all the way then. Although we probably could find one that's a little bit more grown. Where was that 80% one? So we got an 85% one. Black Belt, come cut this one. That one's 21. So 15% takes off 6 of the 27. Yeah, we're about to end up harvesting more cotton anyway. Look at that. We're actually producing medicine. Um, we've already got 27 yayo. I could have swore I told her to take all of it. Critical alert immobile caravan has been formed is now traveling on the world map or to visit invo immobile caravan. One of your caravans is mobile because it carries too much. Take the caravan mobile again by abandoning some items in the items tab. How the fuck is... <sighs> too much weight. Alright, what weighs a crap ton then? The uranium plate armor weighs a lot, but it's also worth a ton. I got 73 kilograms worth of beer. So I got 14 kilograms that I need to ditch. That's annoying. I forgot beer was so heavy. All right, we're good. I had to ditch 50 beer. That's fine. We make a ton of it anyway. And I'm not even close to being done having all of my beer made. How are you for resistance? 3.9. Social bio, nervous, undergrounder. Minor pain, low psychic drone. Somewhat impressive dining room. You don't even have a dining room. She's got a stab scar on her right leg. Can we install a bionic heart in her? I just feel like doing that. Let's install the bionic heart. Go install a bionic heart. Please talk to Quest with Blue Mesa. Fuck you. Ma'am now has a bionic heart. Ooh, hey, a regular heart. I don't remember getting... Oh, I suppose uh, Mission's heart would have been ruined, but I guess we have the regular heart now, too. 
So if I want hearts, I can make bionic hearts. They're worth $500 each. How much does a bionic heart cost to make? Bionic heart is 15 plasteel and 3 advanced components. Yeah, it's not worth it. It's not worth making a bionic heart just to get a human heart. Which would make sense. Unless I've literally got just tons of plasteel and advanced components, but they're worth so much more on their own anyway. Bowman's making drugs. Oh, Bowman's is act Bowman is actually surprisingly intelligent. If I can, I'll probably do like, um, like this one started off as the one person with nothing in the middle of the wilderness. I might do the one rich person and then alter the items and stuff that he gets and then make him like a super badass. Have him be like an underground and live inside a mountain and like really awesome. Sam is no longer inspired for Shoot Frenzy. Now we're at 2.9 resistance on MAM. I have to figure out how I want that, because I will definitely want the hydroponics basin safely underground and everything. You know, Sir had the thing before. Maybe MAM can have it this time. If she joins, I'll give her that, because she'll be disposable. I mean, I'd rather not lose my lesbian, because I want to get another one and have a lesbian couple. Because it's like, you got one half of the pie here, you need the other half. You got all these straight people, and she's just limiting herself to that little tiny niche group. I mean, I'm sure there are plenty of straight guys that would be perfectly fine being with somebody that considers themselves a lesbian, but that's not the way the game works. Then orders to mine out this wall entirely, and all of that wall, and that wall, and that wall, and this wall, and that wall, and that wall, and uh, that wall, and that wall. Oh, Bowman is crafting stone chunks. Yeah, I suppose. Selected specifically. All the shit out of here. There we go. They didn't even have to sleep in open rooms. Oh yeah, it's a solar flare. Oh no, I was I was thinking eclipse for some reason. No, yeah, solar flare. Look at that, now all the rooms are completely wood. I gotta still get the ones in the middle here. And everything over here is fine. I don't give a shit about the walls on that. And then just mine all of that. Major break risk by Epsilon. What the fuck are you pissed off about now? Drowsy? Insulted, darkness, sweaty, disturbed sleep, whatever. I'll group from Navarone are visiting the colony. Is Kate here? Nope. It's gonna be my goal. I gotta find Kate.
I suppose Cody wasn't crafting anything up here because nobody was bothering to do stuff down here. I didn't have the stone required. Oh yeah, where are we on the map? How long until Jen gets there? 1.8 days. I had to take a bunch of stuff to go export it. Uh, how many marine armor? How many advanced components is it for marine armor? So I need four more. A work frenzy, Pockers. Good for you, Pockers. Go get some shit done. If you could make beer, that'd be great. Okay, this embosh is ready to harvest. I could have swore I sent all the leather. I must have killed more animals or something. Major break risk. Shut the fuck up, Epsilon. Let's hunt some boomalope. 2% is not bad. Garrison NG. Let me go back up to my OBS. All right, I think this is where we're gonna go ahead and call this one. Ooh, boy, good trader. Kent up. Call Wulan Interstellar. All right, they've got some huskies. They've got some alpacas. They've got some meat. Let's buy some meat. Warg meat? I've never seen a warg. All the meat's essentially the same. Um, what can we sell them? So the light leather, pig skin, lizard, elephant. Now we're keeping the elephant. Actually, you know what? Fuck it. You can have all my elephant leather. Uh, yeah, yo, you can have that. Flake, I don't need steel, uranium, hops. I'm gonna keep all my hops just because we're good with that. Beer. Black jacket, good. Gold. I want your gold. Uh, wooden bed. I'm not sure why I just have these around, but you can go ahead and have those. You can have the sculpture. Is there anything I see of yours that I want aside from the meat? Cougar meat, squirrel meat. There's a lot of squirrel meat. I don't like the look of squirrel meat. Some warg meat. Some wolf meat. Um, what else? We got chocolate we can sell you. And then we've got a ton of corn, rice, potatoes, etc. I'm about to harvest corn anyway, so here you go. You can have a ton, ton of corn. Also, they don't like... Oh, no, corn is worth the same amount. This is just like... I suppose this is the corn that sat out for a really long time before they finally brought it in. Let's give you all of that. All right, and then it drops off all my shit over here. Look at all my meat. Good. All my wolves are going to be cannibals. Botched. Stop fucking up, Sienna. She's also moving super slow. Why is she moving so slow? Oh, she's got food poisoning. Who fucked up cooking? Oh, it's probably because it's a dirty cooking environment and we've got tons of people going in and out. Can we get all this stuff hauled, by the way, guys? Not assigned hauling to. 
Oh, uh, yeah, Pockers would never do hauling. I'm not going to wake up, sir. <laughs> Alright, well, there's not really a whole point in doing this right now, but we've got enough gold for another layer of the floor in here, so we'll do that. Not that anybody would ever see their bedroom, but anybody that goes in there would be like, wow, this is just ridiculous. There we go, Blackville's not gonna fuck up her own floor. Shit's important. Cody's not gonna mess it up either, so we're good. Three layers. We're still another, we're halfway there. Oh, how is your uh, resistance? You're at zero. Let's recruit you. Unless ma'am decides she's going to do something that makes me really like her, I think she's just going to be left in me. Oh, yeah, right. I was going to leave off. All right. Yeah, we'll, we'll, we'll leave that there. We'll see if ma'am joins us in the next episode. Well, she's guaranteed to, but whatever. 